Big win at the weekend over the Cardiff Blues Select 15 side. So what's the mood in the camp back in training yesterday? Uh, yeah, I think the mood's been pretty good the whole way through. Uh, obviously, um, we'd had a couple of losses, um, some of them quite tight, uh, some of them that we deserved. Um, so, yeah, it was nice to get a win. Uh, obviously, adds uh, a little bit more spring to everyone's step on Monday morning come the meetings and everything could be a little bit more positive, but it's probably just about going forward now and backing that up this weekend and then into the two big derbies coming up over Christmas. Obviously, same opposition this weekend down at Sardis Road. Um, I'd imagine you're expecting the uh, Cardiff side to be probably reeling from the results and a little bit more competitive this weekend uh yeah you'd expect so there's some um, there's some good young lads in there i know a few of them from my days back in uh, in cardiff um the possibility that they might strengthen a little bit as well i suppose being at home and uh, that, that there might be a few more guys available but um you know something that we can't really control so as long as we sort of practice what we want to practice we've, we've had a plan from uh, the end of the bristol game that we've been working on which is going to lead us into the uh, the rotherham and the yorkshire games uh, so as long as we keep developing our game the way we want to uh, everyone else should take care of itself hopefully hey you're touching it there of course going back to cardiff of course ponty frida ground you know very well had some fun times there as a player you looking forward to returning to sardis road yeah i can't wait i've had some uh, some really fun fond memories of uh, of, you know, it was probably sort of five of my best years rugby-wise. Really enjoyed it down there. Like it's a great place to play. Uh, really good crowd down there. It's uh, it's a bit of a shame um, that we're not playing against Ponty. That we're playing against this Blue Select at, uh, at the um, at Silas Road. So probably won't be quite as well supported. Well, it certainly won't be quite as well supported as it could have been if it was against Ponty. But uh, it'd be a great opportunity to go back and play there. And uh, yeah, a ground I've got a lot of fond memories of. And of course, you also mentioned on this, this is the second BNI Cup game before heading into two massive championship derbies, of course, first at Rotherham and then Carnegie down here. How important is it to end 2017 on a high? Oh, it's, it's it's just massive, isn't it? You, uh, you sort of look at what we've achieved over the last two years in this league. We were sort of starting to get a reputation for ourselves as that sort of top four side and a team that was really tough to beat. And over the last couple of weeks, we probably let ourselves down a little bit on that front. So, um, you know, the importance of these three games coming up now is it, it can't really be... Uh, underestimated and um, you know what three wins over the next three weeks could do with us for us would be huge on the flip side what a couple of defeats would do would uh, would be pretty damaging yeah so um, you know we're all pretty clued on to what we what's expected of us over the next couple of weeks and we'll be doing our best to hopefully go out and, uh, and accomplish what we want to and I bring it up because obviously be far too modest to mention it yourself but here on Saturday a perfect display with a boot nine kicks from nine I guess that put a smile on your face at full time yeah it did you know um, I, I, I've been kicking the ball quite well all year and it started quite well, I started off quite well and then I had two games where I felt like I was kicking the ball well but things weren't going my way and things didn't go over and uh, unfortunately down at Richmond it, it probably added to our downfall a little bit um, so you know that's tough to take but uh, I've kept working and I, I, I keep practicing and um, you know when it goes right on the weekend like it did it's, it's, it's always pleasing so uh, yeah like I said I'll try and continue that now through the, the rest of this year and then uh, hopefully into next year as well.